this was to help you with your solutions if you're in year six and you're attempting the worksheet one for literacy uh, of the Ministry of Education um, materials. Okay, so they've given us the beginning of five different sentences and they want us to complete um, the sentence. For C, sentence completion, um, add five or more words to complete each sentence given below. Well, because it's five or more words, you have to uh, make a, a full sentence. So you think about different things that you want to put in there. Now, what might make it easier for you is thinking about the five W's. And this is used in journalism, um, in marketing, anywhere where you need to communicate something and you, you want to capture all the elements. You want to tell a good story. Make sure you've got all the information. So the five W's are who, what, where, when, and why. And there's a bonus in there, how. It, that makes it six, but how doesn't start with W. Uh, there are the systems too. Some say seven W's, but it's those main six elements. So the five W's. So let's look at the first one. When it says, I like eating, okay, like eating what? So what, think about the what, the where, and the when. Even if we were thinking just about those three, what, where, and when, you'd get enough information out of the, thinking about those things to complete the sentence. So I like eating what cake, um, where, at home, when, after dinner. I like eating cake at home after dinner. Okay. So you have one idea right there. Cake at home after dinner. All right. Think about the second one. The party was held. And for C, sentence completion, um, we're told here to add five or more words to complete each sentence given below. Okay, easy enough, but I'd like to help you make it um, a better sentence in less time. Okay, so number one, I like eating. Something that you can, a trick that you can use is to think of the five W's. Who, what, where, when, how, and a bonus one. Actually, the bonus one is how. Who, what, where, when, why, and how. So there are five W's in there, plus there's an H. And I've written it up here. You can see here, who, what, where, when, why, and how. Now, I like eating. We can use the who is already in there. It's I. Um, you can think about what, where, and when. What do you like eating? Cake? Shall we use cake? Okay. Where? At home? When? After dinner? Okay, let's try that one. Cake. So I like eating cake at home after dinner. We'll stop. We'll just put it on one line. Right, so I like eating cake at home after dinner. So I've got the five words in there. Next one, the party was held. Uh, we can start again with what, where, and when. Okay, um, what is already there. So that's the party. Um, where and when? At 
say your friend's house, okay? The party was held at my friend's house. And when? Last night, okay? At my friend's, oops, friend's apostrophe S, house last night. Stop, we put it on one line. Okay, the next one, as soon as the bell rang. Okay, when the bell rings, what are you thinking? You're going to go and open the door? You're already expecting somebody? Okay, who, what, where, when? Um, okay, you can think about the who. And you can think about the, maybe the why. Why are they there? All right. As soon as the bell rang, I ran to the door. So this is the why. Because I had been waiting for the pizza delivery. It's a whole lot of words, but sorry. Okay, I ran to the door because I'd been waiting for the pizza delivery. Okay. Reading can what, where, when, how, why, okay. Um, reading can do what? Uh, reading can help me enjoy stories. Oh, reading can help you pass the exams. Why? Because you'd be able to read your exam papers. Um, reading can improve your life because it'll help you enjoy storybooks. Okay, that's one option. Improve your life because you can um, enjoy story books. Okay, it will stop. Instead of can, you can put you will be able to enjoy storybooks so it's the reading can okay why because you'll be able to enjoy storybooks and and what so what and why okay washing your hands Okay, and this time, uh, especially during the pandemic, washing your hands can keep your hands clean, can keep disease away, can keep COVID away. Okay, so if it can keep COVID away, so washing your hands, why can keep COVID away? Uh, okay, will keep COVID away. And how? Um, by killing the bacteria, by killing the viruses on your hands. Okay. Can keep COVID-19 away by, so this is the how part, by the virus 
says on your hands if there are viruses on your hands okay that's that's one uh, way of adding uh, words to your sentence whether it's to complete or start a sentence and what can give you ideas is again what I said who what when why and how Um, click on the playlist to watch similar videos or other videos in this series um, on this uh, same worksheet and click here to subscribe.